Okay, several of you in the church have asked us uh, for somebody's phone number. How do I get a hold of them? What's their address? I want to send them something. Or even, hey, what's that woman's name? Who? And uh, that's why we have this instant church directory. It's not the old kind of, kind of directories where we drag your family down to the church and you have to pose awkwardly and wear a sweater. It's just an easy way that we might connect better as a community. And some of you are thinking, well, I'm not a member of Hope. If Hope is the place you show up the most, if that's where you say, this is my tribe where I'm growing in my faith, regardless of any other whatever, please get on the instant directory. It'd be really helpful for us to just to stay connected as a family. So I'm going to walk you through this. Step one is you're going to open your email and you're going to start by addressing an email to Blake at hopeforwilmington.com. So go ahead and do that. You can pause the video. Blake at hopeforwilmington.com. You will put your name and the name of whoever is in your family. If you're single, great. If you have a large extended family that all lives with you, put them all down. Your address and then kind of the primary email addresses for the people in the home. And then phone numbers for whoever you want us to have a phone number for. Um, and that's just so people can reach out. If there's a number you don't want us to have, don't put it down. Uh, and then would you send in a picture? Do not feel like you have to send in some, you know, beautiful whatever. It can be just a selfie with a bunch of faces. Um, quality doesn't matter. It can be silly if you want. But a picture really does help. So send that email with that information names, address, email address, phones, and a picture to Blake. Then when Blake enters that in to the thing called the Instant Church Directory, she'll send you back an email and let you know it shouldn't take long. And then what you'll do is you'll go to an app store on your phone. And so you're gonna download a thing called Instant Church Directory. So go do that right now, look at your app store. And it looks like, I don't know if you can see that, that's the little green, thing that the, is their symbol. So you go there and you download that app. And once you do that and put it on your phone, you'll enter in the email address that you gave to Blake. And then you'll just create a password and you'll follow just some simple instructions uh, to confirm your password. And by the way, make it a password that you're going to remember. Don't be one of those crazy ones. You're not putting secret information on here. And then after you confirm your password, you'll go back to the app on your phone and enter in your email and your password. And then you're good. It's on your phone. You can use it for whenever you need it. And especially in times, you know, that we've gone through hurricanes with COVID-19, it's just helpful to know who folks are and to reach out to them so you can connect and pray for them. So if your information is incorrect, you just always let Blake know and she'll edit it. There you go. Instant Church Directory. Do us a favor. Sign up.